Right guys, well today we've had something special through the workshop. Let me not just say today, it's been a few weeks of working out how we're gonna do this to honestly probably be the best brooder setup in Australia. Um, for those of you who don't know, brooder trailers or caravans is probably one of the world's premium or leading um, designers and manufacturers of off-road caravans and camper trailers. And this is the XP4 model, which is designed effectively for two people on the inside, as well as what we can do, is attach a tent on the top end. Today we had the privilege of installing our TX27 Max roof top tent as well as two 180 degree XT Max awnings to give you the ultimate touring setup whether it's for two or four or even five people with the big Max on the top. So going through the actual unit itself is on the inside you've got a nice spacious double bed layout with ample storage at your feet as well as your head. There's two additional fans and a whole bunch of lighting, interior lighting, so you can also have your reading lights on if you were, say, to read a book inside. Now, on the two side units where you've also um, added accessory storage, you basically have your full Victron lithium battery system. Now that's gonna be your DC-DC chargers, your solar input charger regulators, with all your inverter sets ready up to run induction cooktops, you name it, a heap of power in this unit. On the driver's side of the unit as well, and this it is the diesel heater. So for those cold winter months up in the high country, or if you're snow-stricken areas, guys, you can have ample heating inside of this and comfort. The rear kitchen, we'll get onto in a short moment, and I'll actually take you through and show you a bit about the kitchen. As far as the setup goes, and I must be honest, it is absolutely stunning. When you take two premium products in the marketplace, or two premium brands, shall I say, and merge them, you honestly have a masterpiece. And I hope you guys appreciate this video, it's, it's stunning. So what we've done on the front end is added on these custom rails, and this allows us to have our fold down ladder. Now from the front here, it gives you ample room to get up on the drawbar, flip the landing platform, as you were to call it, down, and extend the ladder to suit. Now make sure that locks into place, and that's just gonna lean on the drawbar, giving us easy access onto the, the top of this tent, or on the top of the van rather, to get into the tent. Now what I first have to do is undo the latches on the rear. Because it is the TX Max, it's a double opening tent, so we have additional roof latches on the rear. So I'm gonna get up there, unlatch that side, simply walk around, and do the opposite side, like that. Now's the easy part. Walk around and we can actually start to set up the full setup of the tent. So getting up on the drawbar, onto the large landing platform as you can see, heaps of comfort, a lot of safety in here as well. So basically you're not gonna fall off of it. It's a really large platform, nice and wide and easy to stand up on. So popping the tent open, we're gonna allow the gas struts to do all the heavy lifting for you. Literally pull down the bungee strap, grab your two longer spring rods. Now these can be inserted into the sides of the tent and then into the eyelets on the top of the rain fly, giving you that nice bit of coverage over the front of the tent, like that. Now inside to pop open the second layer. So on the inside here, there's a Velcro strap which we can undo and the lid will literally pop up into its second layer with the gas struts. So getting out to the external, just have to zip down the fly mesh and I'm really showing this off as if it was a real, real life situation. Taking your bungee cord, bringing it all the way down to the bottom. Now this bungee helps it fold up on itself when you go to put it in. Now, insert that into the stainless steel spring rod receiver and clip it into the eyelets. This is gonna give you ample airflow through the entire tent and a great view as well. As you can see out, so even in a rainy situation, you can leave your windows down to get that cross for ventilation. Now on the, this trailer, we've also fitted two of our 180 XT Max awnings. Now, the big reason for having double up, other than obviously double the shade or the rain protection, is that you've actually got dual entry doors on the Bruder EXP4. So if your partner wants to come out the opposite side, you want to come out this side, you're actually protected under cover. Now, as far as our 180s go, they are fully freestanding. As you know, however, you do still tie them down in very windy conditions. Now having them open, we're gonna let them hang together. Now, as it, if it was just one awning you were going to use, you can strap the straps back to the tent itself. What I'm gonna do is just literally let them hang like that because we're gonna be strapping the two awnings to each other. So bring this around. 
and temporarily gonna just hook it on there. There we go. While I open up the other awning and one on the passenger side, exactly the same process. Zip the bag open, pop down the two Velcro straps, fold out the front arms first and then followed by the rear. There we go. All right, now ready to connect them up. So what we've done and what we've found works the best with these, because you can get the, the best tension out of them, is literally to connect them together. So with the carabiner clip in the middle, we can pull these together equally until they pull out to their 90 degree mark, as you can see. Now, even though it is hanging there, it still gives you ample entry point and space to get up on the ladder and actually enter the top of the tent. Now going to the rear, exactly the same process. Open them up all the way. I'm just gonna extend this one. There we go. Like that. Get into this one. And latch them together like that. And that will then allow us to tension them up equally. And the nice thing is, you can definitely see down either side of the van by just peering down the sides how to tension them. Now guys, as I said before, if you just wanted to open one, you can hook the actual strap with one awning back to the tent itself on either side. So if you just wanted to run one at a time. In this instance, we just wanted to show you both of them and it comes up an absolute treat. So tension on that. Now for the kitchen part, and this is really nice. Now these rear doors are massive. And as you can see, you have got your cameras or your rear vision cameras on there, um, which is perfect. Your number plate effectively fits up there with your lights. Big handle and a Max Trax holder. So a really great place, nice and low, to actually store your Max Trax out of the way. Now I'll just pop up the kitchen. Now the kitchen rear door is large enough that it actually acts as its own coverage. So open that up, and there we go. Beautiful. So you've got plenty of space under the cover of this and simply just pop underneath the awning and you can run up and down the length of this. Now, as you can see in the kitchen, an upright fridge freezer combination over there, Dometic version. All of your electronic display panels, all of the little cupboards, basin basically, or kitchen sink if you want to call it that, pull out drawer systems, you name it, fire extinguisher and plenty of top storage. The perfect long weekend and in fact, even a touring trailer. Compact, lightweight, and stunning. And one stunning thing which is absolutely a Bruder must is you guys got to go watch some of the videos and the intro videos on the Bruder caravans. But the reality is the suspension system is unreal. So if you're a really tall person and you wanted to lift it up a little bit, not a major drama at all. By push of a button, the air suspension will give you huge lift, self-leveling, as you can see, I've got plenty of walking space underneath this awning now. Guys, thank you for watching this rig review, walkthrough of a Bruder EXP4 camper trailer. And an absolute weapon. The job came out superbly. It's got our TX27 Max rooftop tent, as well as our two 180 XT Max awnings. For more information on our product, don't forget to go to thebushcompany.com. We've got a huge list of dealers up on our website. So go and grab them around the world. And um, don't forget to go bush. I will catch you later.